is up YouTube, Lazy Lime here, and here we are back with some more Idle Heroes once again. And a new event has come around. Um, obviously, this whole thing is still finishing up with letting you claim claim your seven days if you, if you haven't. They give you actually a couple extra days because I even missed, I think, a day in between. So they give you a couple extra days to, to get your seven days claimed, which is really cool. Um, Relic wise, we're at 30. That's not bad. That's not bad. I mean, as far as penny goes, it's halfway. Halfway to a penny. That's what I look at it as. But, um, we got a couple things going on. We have Wishing Fountain with Verdia, which would technically give me three, because I already got two in the bag. I did use up my other one I already had summoned. What I think I'm going to do is, because I'm actually doing, like, okay with stuff. I don't think I have many, not in here. Um, during the Heroic Miracle, we don't have many five stars. We actually have no five stars. But I have two six stars. I think the goal is going to be to work Berea towards a nine star. Because I have the copies for him. Like, when I can, like, that's what I'll put things into. Get him towards nine star. I'll use these two as food for him. Because uh, we'll have three copies. And then, not use him. Um, I know that, that sounds weird. We're not going to actually use Berea. Even though he's decent. Um, we're going to use him as food for uh, probably a penny upgrade. Or something. I mean, um, a Sigmund would, could be cool. And speaking of Sigmund, show the missions. The only thing I actually care about here, because I really don't need the gear anymore. I, I don't think it's... I mean, it, the gear is nice, because it does let me add up and build six-star gear. But it's not, like, super important anymore to have this gear, to be honest. And I really don't want to spend the resources on any of these. I mean, I, I don't have this. I don't want to try to make it. I, I don't care enough about any three of these. Like, I'm not building up any of them. So I'm going to skip out on the sheltered missions there. Except for this, I'm going to try to get this done. Which, I mean, we could trade this away or this away. I'll actually probably trade this, even though this is considered elite. Uh, she's used in more crafting. Um, so I think I'd rather get rid of him. And then I do need to get some warrior four stars. And I don't know if we even have any four stars. And this could be the problem. I may have to try to force this out of the system. Not in here. What, what am I doing? I can't click. Um, yeah, we have no four stars. Uh, why do we have, we have so many three stars there? Um, so we're going to need to get some four stars. We're going to need some four stars. And the issue is, we have one, two, she's a warrior, right? Almost positive, she's a warrior. Yeah, two, and we have three. So we need one more. And those are the only warriors that are a thing. Um, so do we have anything else? We do. Because we'll, we'll have to just cycle. I have a couple branches, I think. So let's do that. Let's summon... Actually, let's not summon any of you yet. Let's just summon a normal four star. Um, that we're not close to building. Oh, he's a warrior. Yeah. We got him, too. You know what? Let's just do that. Let's not even send any branches. Someone wanted him. I hate wasting him, to be honest. Do you know what? I'm just going to use all of this guy. I think he's used in less, if I'm not mistaken. But, again, the only shelter mission I care about. I would suggest trying to get as many of these done as you can. But realistically, for me, like, it's not for the gear anymore. It's literally for the copies of heroes. And that gives me another Sigmund copy, which, no joke, we have a 9-star Sigmund. Um, I now have 4 Sigmunds banked, which is 10-star, E1, E2, and E3 banked Sigmunds. I can build an E3 Sigmund with, with the copies of him, not obviously the food for him. But technically, I mean, obviously Penny is priority, and I don't really want to spend any other 9-stars uh, and anything other than Penny, but you can see we have the Brias here, and once we do the Wishing Fountain, we're going to be in solid shape for that. And again, we're going to go sh through straight due to the Wishing Fountain, we're going to do everything. Um, I'm going to throw myself off a little bit here. Um, I know the gem box event's probably next week, and we have a decent bit of gems, which is nice. And this might not be great, but I'm doing it. Um, we're going to be sending trading in Penny's gear. We're going to be spending a lot of gold. You might see I got a lot of gold. I got... I got some big achievement that gave me 80, 80, 80 million gold. I forget what achievement it was. Um, but I'm spending gold. Um, this might be dumb, but it's the only way to get best gear. And because she's becoming such a beast, I mean, it's a pretty big upgrade. So you'll see here, um, yeah, I get the extra tank and stuff. And that's mighty fine if you finish the whole suit. Uh, but look, Penny's about one hitting. And this gear ups everything here, ups, ups the, like all the bonuses um, on each piece. Those all give HP. Um, seven percent, and this gives attack. And if I'm wearing the whole set, look at that crit and attack percent. That's all I care about. We need it. We need it. It could be dumb. I might regret it. You guys can yell at me in the comments if it's bad. I've never had a full set. Let's get her max gear. 
Let's just do it. Why not, you know? It, it, it does sing because I won't have anything for Gembox. Because, um, again, we're free-to-play account for anyone new to this that might be hopping in here and never seen an episode of this. Uh, I've, everything I've done is free-to-play. Uh, and we, we plan to stay that way. But Ranger Scent, that is correct. Ranger. It's, it's the bow. I want to make sure I don't do a wrong one. 4,000. Ooh, it's so expensive. So expensive. But, man, is that amazing. Oh, that's going to be so awesome. I don't really care about getting anyone else in, in max sense anytime soon. So that's going to, once again, increase her numbers to be drastic. I don't know what like, max crit percent is, but she's going to be in. She is going to be hitting. And that's at least a bit of um, like just everything added. The attack's nice. I mean, the health. I didn't actually look at the health upgrades, but it's, it's good. It's good. Um, I haven't swapped that artifact around. I still have it over here on Sigmund. Um, and speaking of that, during the last event, I did spend a little bit of gems. You may have noticed I'm, I'm still even down. I did spend a little bit, and I traded a full red thing that we earned for a orange artifact in hopes. Okay, not great. Oh, it's good for light heroes, which kind of stinks. Um, damage against reach, 9% HP. I mean, it's nice. It, it's, it's better than than other things <laughs> that I have. Um, and again, would be good against priests. Sadly, I don't have any light heroes on the team. Uh, I, I don't. We're actually going to do this. I'm going to summon one of these. Because I am going to be doing Wishing Fountain, obviously. Um, hmm. I mean, we spent so much money. So we still have so much. It's crazy. Um... What was I going to do? Probably throw this on someone. I don't know who to throw it on. I mean, you think like something like this. This is actually not a bad thing. 7% attack uh, and 7% HP. I like the... Okay, this is good for dark. So I could throw this on um, Amon. It might not be a bad idea. I could move some of these around. These red ones, I, I almost want to level up a little bit too. I mean, this is this is max. Um, it's good on Fortress. Uh, you get the extra attack percent, which is tempting, really, really tempting to put this on Penny. And I might do that. It's just she's really nice with the um, getting her CC immunity. You know what? Let's play around with it on uh, on Penny instead. Let's play around with it. Why does it put that on? Is that considered like better? I don't know. Maybe it is. Let's put that one on though. Which should give her 14% attack there. Attack here. Definitely going to raise her attack up. I mean, it was 80-something thousand. It, it's a lot higher. Like, I get it. We get an extra attack here. We made Penny pretty beefy damage-wise. Uh, let's move a couple of these things around. Um, maybe we... Uh, who do I want the skill thing on? Maybe Cruz? That's what we tested it on before. Um, I keep hitting upgrade. Maybe Cruz, because Cruz's ability, for anyone who doesn't know, Cruz, Cruz is pretty strong. Um, and I'd love to get Cruz up, and I was hoping to save all of that food we had for Cruz later on, because if we get another copy, I'd love to get this and be able to bring him up. But we need 10 star anyways, and we kind of have a decent setup to build one in that in that faction. So, And we need two copies of him, which we have we have none of. Um, oh yeah, I gotta do that with Sigmund, sorry. I don't have enough for E3, I have enough for E2 Sigmund. Because there's two copies to go to 10 star, my bad. Um, people probably have already yelled at me in the comments, but... Um, what I'm trying to show you is this active skill. So deals um, damage against four random enemies and weakens the target for three rounds, increasing 75% uh, energy, increasing 75% energy to a random ally. So right there, he's gonna buff an ally, uh, and targets afflicted with weakness mark take an extra 50% damage. It does not stack, but they take an extra 50% damage. So getting that off right off the bat. It could be game changing, and we we tested it. It just I was doing more with Penny before, but again, I didn't actually put this on and do all the testing. Um, this I think we're definitely going to remove and put on Amon. Uh, and I don't know if I want to put that on you. Give her some survivability. Cruise may or maybe put it on him actually for now. Like it just it's damage against priests. It's nothing crazy. Um, I think I'll actually throw it on him. Uh, I do want to put this one over here on Amon. What is this? Damage against Rangers. Um, and you got a garbage one, huh? Um, so that's dark. So it gives 15% control immunity, which is good. 
Um, that's definitely a very good thing to have. I think I want to put one of these. I mean, I don't know which one. I want to put this one over. Oh, this is the same thing, actually. Let's just put the better one here. So that should be everyone. Should be some team upgrades. I know we're spending a lot of time here. We're going to go through all the the wheel spins here for you guys too so yeah that, that's looking good we're, we're in good shape we are in good shape i'm happy with the way things have gone for sure and i do think if the time comes i am going to try to make a six star one of these just to get rid of some of my inventory i know it's like if we get Amon because then we wouldn't put the build or as much but man this inventory is rough i think i think i have everything to build them already right no it's this crap we would need that um all right well we can't do it anyways but um yeah, that that's good. That, that's making the team look good. I'm happy with that. Let's uh, let's pop in here and kind of check some things out. See if I can get some bigger numbers on the bosses. Um, it's just more about survivability most of the time for me. And you know what we could do too? We could check. I probably have a little bit of tech. Yeah, a little, little bit of tech to spend. Uh, not much. Definitely spends a lot of money in there. That's maxed. Now it's just a matter of getting this nine more levels, and then we have this whole ranger tree max, which is kind of the goal at the moment. Um, that's that's what I'm looking forward to. Before we do anything, though, uh, let's pop in here to our beautiful little pet and uh, upgrade this a couple times. Uh, not very much, but what that HP is high as possible right now. That's definitely the most valuable thing to me uh, by far, just getting that up. Um, it would be cool is when we max that pet, technically we'd be able to build up another pet or save everything in case they come up with a new pet, um, which is kind of cool. Uh, I, I, I guess, I don't, I don't know what people normally do when when they max a pet, but obviously maxing the pet is going to take forever. But uh, it would be cool. So this should have enough health for me to kind of get a good thing. I'm doing okay damage to this one. It does range a little bit. I think this is going to do much nicer. It's just Penny doesn't have the CC immune, so if things that have CC immunity uh, might be rough. Um, and we have a little less, uh, yeah, a little less HP on some people, but it doesn't matter in this one. We just we just go down. 15 million, that's definitely an improvement on the average that I've been doing. Uh, so we can do that again consecutively, get around that. I'd be really happy. Again, Cruz starts with the full energy. So on his turn, he gets that buff going. So technically, Penny doesn't get her thing till now. She looks like she has her armor already, which is weird. Uh, but just putting it in slow to kind of explain kind of what's happening there with Cruz getting that. Again, Heart Watcher doesn't get any of her debuffing because she's lower i'd love to build her up to the next star and at some point i'd love to focus a little bit on forest um to do that because we, we need to focus on forest a little bit to actually make that happen but right now penny is so good if she gets another attack in ah i would say that's gonna be looking good uh 10 million again definitely an improvement on where we're at um definitely hitting a lot harder which is nice uh, i don't know how much that actually is going to do for changing my team around we got the brave child going on too which i'm actually we're not going to do any of today i forgot we need to do this we need to get through this. Um, we have a bunch of these to open. Let's go. Uh, we're probably going to just do it all right now. Although, I don't know. It's it's really inefficient. And, like, doing the wheel together isn't that important. Um, I mean, there's a chance we can get some stuff. But, like, technically, we already got what we wanted off this wheel. There's no point to send this wheel. And, actually, everything's really bad on the wheel. And this is technically even worse. I mean, we'll go, obviously, grab what we want off it. But I don't want to be spending so many gems re-rolling these wheels. Um, I really don't. Um, how many of these we got, by the way? I picked up those already. Can be refreshed for free. Really? And then it costs 50. Oh, but I can get another ref Oh, so you just have to wait. Okay. So, I mean, getting Lux, Lux is something we could also build up to actually to 9. So maybe we'll do that as 9 star food. Because I have a lot of shadow stuff too. I don't think I'm as built up in shadow. We have a good bit. We'll, we'll do one of these. Hopefully for more gold and... Ah, it's back to the... Like, it's decent gold. It's just that I care about more. I don't know if that's the max gold I can have. I don't know if there's a way to, way to tell. But the spirit's not very good. The spirit is not very good. You know what we also could probably do? Is we could probably upgrade other people's armors. Not in the blacksmith event, but I could definitely probably forge some more um, six-star gear and put some people in a little bit worse gear, but it's obviously worth it to buff up a certain people. Oh, keeping everyone alive right now is just so important. That was actually technically where I'm supposed to end. 
so you know what? I don't think I'm going to do this. You guys probably won't see them on videos. So I really don't want to keep refreshing it. And I kind of want to do it more efficient. Last time I didn't do it efficient. I mean, we get refunded some here. But I really want to try to get some for the gem box. At least by... I'm actually... I think we already have what we need. Unless it's 2400 uh, But the Profit Orb gem box. We definitely need that. I mean, we're still... I feel it's so far away for me to be... We do actually... Ooh. Oh, you know what? Do I need... No, we're doing it. We're going for the the two random hopeful chances. That penny, nope, is going to be right here. Boom. Rip. Um, all right. Well, that sucks. I was really hoping for something there. We actually get, we do get some from this. I forgot. We do get, I mean, how many total? What is it, six? Yeah, six. Uh, no, eight. Eight from that total, which is actually pretty good. Um, not bad, and we'll have some of these. I did already check because I was going to do these today, too. I'm waiting for Penny to show up on the wheel again, basically. Although, I'm not only going to do it for Penny. I mean, I will I will definitely go for it for, for someone else. Um, but I'm, I'm excited to get some of our heroes just well a more, little more well-rounded. I mean, can, I know that's not really efficient. Uh, but I'd like to get some other people up, get Vesa up. Um, I don't know if I want to use her as 9-star food. I haven't decided. There's part of me that just, like, really just wants to get, just get rid of her kind of deal. Um, and I might. I might just be like, all right, you're gone, be food. But another part of me is like, no. We definitely could start building up a locks. Like, it, it could happen. I don't know what the th other five-star food is. Yeah, we don't have him. I mean, we could maybe get him. I think I opened some of this before. Yeah, because we got our eight and up. That's what, that's what we used. We need, we need another f food. We need more food because Penny is going to need it soon. She's going to need it. Oh, you know what? Just reminded me. You guys have been probably seeing it all episode. I got this as well. Um, let's get a penny skin right here. Wait, what? Is that ice blink? That's definitely ice blink. Uh, that's a... Oh, no, it looks like the same rarity. Uh, nothing good. You guys are saying to save them, though, and not dismantle them like I was? That you can like craft them up or something? I'm not exactly sure how to do that. I'm assuming it's in here. Um, what else do you need? Can you like choose what you want to make? Like, is penny like is there a penny skin in here that we like, could use? I'm assuming we could, or maybe it's a ra it's probably a random one. Um, use five normal skins to fuse until yeah, random limited skin except holiday skins. Tap the modifier icon for available skins to be fused. Once the skins fuse, skin material will be consumed. Is it just these you need a skin material? Is that it? Like, you don't need to spend money or gold or... It doesn't look like it. It does not look like it. And also, my monthlies are going to be resetting in 48 hours, which is pretty cool. Uh, I'm excited to get a new of those. We get a bunch of gold coming in from here again. Um, and we will get... I mean, we'll get some stuff from them. Um, I can get through all that and get profit orbs and and things. I'm, I'm very excited for the Heroic Miracle event. That's that's what I'm excited the most for. I mean, I just also don't want it to come along because that's the same as the Prophet Orb, and when that comes, I want to make sure I'm at 80. Like, I want to get a full completion. I hate the stupid half completion thing. It's just Prophet Orbs are, are rough. Like, they are rough to get. I mean, we better grab a couple from here. One. Uh, I do really well in the arena without even trying anymore. My, my arena team is dirty. Like, I... I, I don't even attack. Like, I stay above 100 without even attacking. I did, And I was looking through to see kind of if we had any members in here. And it looks like a uh, Heshmer hangs up in the... Normally, he's around here. Yeah. He hangs up there. He was in the 1600s before. Um, but we hang up there. I mean, we could we could push, too. Like, I could I could easily push. I mean, I can take out some teams. Let me show you an example. I think I've already, I've already bragged about this. It's pretty cool. Like, this team... Uh, I can eat your penny. Never mind. Um... But there has been some teams about the, this this level mark. This one could be possible. It depends if we take the Valk out. But the Horus, honestly, probably can't deal with us alone. It just matters if we one-shot everything else. And I don't necessarily want to risk it. Um, cause it, don't, you know, it really doesn't matter. Let's do it. I know someone mentioned actually something about a, the friendship battle event. Or things that we do. We haven't done that in a while. I get that. We'll have to do it again soon. Um... They're a lot faster than us. Nah, Penny got a really bad hit. It's probably a loss right off the bat then because of it. It's a matter basically of uh, if Penny gets a big crit and just takes him out, which isn't going to happen. Um, yeah, the Valk's still up. She's not going to get it done. But I can take out teams around that that range. Um, I have taken out a one that was 1.3 mil. Um, and then I can take out a lot of these ones. 
quite often. That's Sigmund, I think. I don't have Sigmund skin. But it, it's really cool. It's cool to be able to take out teams with such higher power than me. Um, I'm just over 700k. It's, it's kind of crazy. Uh, but that's about it, guys. That's, that's about it. I'm not, I'm not going to go through this with you guys. It's a little boring. Uh, maybe we'll get something good from it. I'll show you guys next episode. But uh, next episode will most likely be the friend battle thing, maybe. I, I don't know. Um, maybe I'll merge that when we get a 116 because it's kind of the same thing. The 116, I do the campaign push. I normally we do tower. And maybe we'll do the friend battle in that. Um, I'll go through a couple people and we'll do a couple matches. I've already ran it a lot of people. Um, it's weird because like people like uh, um, like Sir has a like his his team to PVE is so much better than me. But oh my god, like right now my team has been destroying him. Um, I've been I've been testing out some things. I think he's actually one that wanted. It. We'll we'll do it right now. Quick little thing because I know he asked. Um, I'm sure, and he can obviously do it, but um. Penny goes in, dude, and his they, he can win, but it's been brutal. And again, the thing not being on Penny, I feel like she doesn't get her big crit up as much. But yeah, when she does it, it's just it's that every time, and it's crazy to see one person that he's got an e e two. Um, I don't know if he plans to go to e five, or what the plan is when he's gonna stop leveling it. Um, I know most people don't take that on. Um, I don't take that up much more. How's Torchic's team? Oh yeah, it's. Torchic fell, fell down a little bit. I, and I TD... I, I'm going to do a video specified for this. I don't want to do too much of this. I know I was wrapping this up. Uh, but TD, I haven't, I haven't done too much testing with him. He says it's about a 50-50 ratio with us. But again, I changed things around. So it could either be positive or negative for me. Um, but his Penny, I guess, is faster than mine. With something he's got going on. So, But Penny should get a big banger. Yeah. It's a big banger right here. You can just feel it coming. I just I smell it. I smell it and it just does 20 million damage in one hit. Uh, but I guess I guess about 50% of the time. But again, their teams, PvP or EYs, destroy me. Look at this. Both of them. Absolutely slaughter me. TD's three times mine and Sir is six times. I think I did miss one day. But still, nonetheless, I the one day at the time I was only getting like most of the battles weren't giving me more than like five mil. It's just like it's so rough. Uh, we're, we're hitting pretty hard. I almost want to test that with another one. But we're hitting pretty hard. And that extra crit, I mean, it's brutal. Um, we got one more little test because this is going to reset. And we're not going to have a video before then. I don't know. I'm just dragging this on and on. Some of you will appreciate it, but... We'll go into this real quick. And you can see kind of the whole team come together and see how much more Penny's getting. I forget what I was roughly getting before... I mean, this is a, this is a rough one because they reduce crit, but I think the switch arounds are good. And let me know if you think I should move the relics a little more around. Let me know what you guys think. Um, a lot of you guys think that stuff through a little bit better than I do, so I'm definitely down to here. But I think it's a pretty good lineup. Um, and opening the skill thing on Amon wouldn't be bad either, but she's got that other thing, so I figured why not give her some crowd control immunity. Um, it's not really that that ruins her, it's, it's normally just her lower HP because she's a 5 star, but we have so much HP coming in from our pet now. It's kind of crazy. But this this thing is still just, it's not really viable to, to be able to beat this. Especially being a team that uses crit as my main, my main source of attack. But I really want to get Penny up, and I mean, I want to get Sigmund up, but he's he's going to just be on the back burner for a long time, and I'm going to be so tempted to use him as food, and I hate the idea of it. I don't want to use him as food, but like, if I get another Penny Cappy, I'm going to be so tempted to just throw someone away. And like, Heart Watcher's too good. You can't throw away Heart Watcher. Cruz, I, I love so much. I, I can't get rid of Cruz, and he's not 9 star anyways. Yeah, he's not 9 star. Um... Vesa, like, she's my healer, so, like, even if I had her at 9-star, like, that's what I mean. Like, I don't want to get rid of her. I don't know what other healer I use. Like, I could bring out my 5-star uh, Berlane and have a light hero, and then, like, we're technically getting close to a rainbow team. Like, I would just have to get rid of the Sigmund for something Shadow, which Horus would be sweet, but I have to get more, more of him. Like, I have to build him up. And, like, I still almost feel like it's not worth getting rid of Sigmund for PvE purposes. Because I feel like Sigmund's so good with that armor strip. And, I mean, even PvP is pretty good with it. Um, I don't know if, like... I don't know if I'd want to keep both of them. Like, because you get to the point, I feel like, in the game where you have... You have different teams. You have one for PvE and one for PvP. Um, 
So I'm wondering, like, what do you guys think if all of a sudden I get two copies of Horus? Do I say screw Sigmund and drop the idea of even building him and use him as food? Like, I almost want to hop and chat with, with a couple of you guys that are really good, like, like more experienced at the game. And I mean, I only know a couple of people like, you know, Hashmir, I know he's very knowledgeable. Um, TD seems very knowledgeable. I mean, I, I could hop in the Discord. Uh, I don't know his Discord, but, like, I don't want to go in there for advice. I'd rather get it from the community. Uh, and I know there's a bunch of you guys on different servers that are knowledgeable. But it's like, what should be my goal? And that would give me a rainbow team if I do that. Because that would be light instead of Vesa. And then um, shadow instead of Sigmund. And that gives me a rainbow team. Like, it's it'd be two five stars in it. And I get it. There's no Ada in it. Like, it's it's not going to build Ada. Which, honestly, I'm okay with. Like, I know people love Ada and she does, she's crazy. I don't really want to build her. Like, because everyone builds her. Like... I don't want to. Like, I'm fine with Penny's damage. Like, I would love to get Valk on the team, too, because I have a one Valk copy, but it's like... There's so many good heroes. Like, what do I do? Sigmund actually died at the end. What? Wait, what is that? 123 million? That actually seems kind of low. Is that... I feel like that's low for Penny. No, maybe not. I feel like that... For some reason, that feels low. Um, I don't know. That felt low, but... Nonetheless, I'm going to wrap this up, guys. I've dragged this on in actually like 10 minutes. If you guys enjoyed this video, please take a second, smack the like button. And as always, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.